I'm proud of Fabio how he is coping with that, you know, because he knows he's got no chance at some tracks and he still does his best. And now we're at a track he has got a chance. He does his best and he shows what how good he is, you know. That's what he said, isn't it? Actually, to be fair to him, he says, Worry. <laughs> you threw them. Well, we've got a spectacular location here in Lombok. They told us this news. What drama, what a day to remember it here at the Pertamina Mandalika circuit. MotoGP really did deliver on our first Saturday here in Indonesia for 25 long years. I'm sure you'll all agree it was well worth the wait. And we've still spectacular action here today. How do you try and sum up what happened in FP4? What happened in particular in Q1? And at the end of play, a warm embrace between the two Frenchmen on the front row, either side of Jorge Martin. Good afternoon for Pramit Ducati with yeah. Martin and Zarco on that front row. And in particular, like you mentioned, Sai, after what important and crucially, he will start tomorrow's Grand Prix of Indonesia from pole position. If you believe in omens, well, there it was from Fabio. Pole position, it looks like he's down in part for me, ready to talk to Jack. Fabio, that signature smile is back once again, and it looks like you're back in the game as well. Congratulations. Yes, thank you. Um, was great to, to be to be back in uh, in here. Was was a long time. So yeah, super happy, and uh, I'm even more happy with my FP4 that actually I made 15 laps in a row. Uh, really good pace, and uh, of course my my two laps on, on qualifying were, were fast. The last one I I tried to push, but on this track it's only the first lap. If you make a mistake on the first lap, you know that. The second lap is going to be worse, and uh, I think that uh, we make not so much mistake today on the qualifying, and I think that that pays off. So thanks to the team because we never give up, uh, even with bad results, we we are here again and uh, feeling great for tomorrow. So that's the most important. Congratulations. Thank you. He looks great. He obviously feels great. There's a. A bit of a confident swagger about Fabio Quattararo there, Simon. So, without sounding overconfident, but you can just sense that he knows he's got a great chance of winning here tomorrow. Yeah, I really would like now to go and study FP4 and see how long he can keep that soft rear tyre going because that's what it's going to come down to. Yeah, to be proud. One more thing I can see looking at the, the timesheets here is Anea Bastianini in fifth i believe you know he's the championship leader i believe he and the team will be in their box right now it's quiet race day here tomorrow if that didn't whet your appetite well nothing will fabio quattararo then will start from pole position courtesy of a brilliant 131 067 on the front row with the